What do you want? I can't say I'm prepared to speak to you about that. Goodbye. What do you want? It appears you've spoken to Lavana. I know she sounds a bit like a raving madwoman, but she isn't far from the truth. Ulrich is definitely up to something. Every day, we take in exorbitant fines from the people. Where most of the money goes, <laughs> I have a good idea. Ulrich keeps his quarters locked, but I've glimpsed inside. The things he has in there could never be purchased on a captain's salary. At first I thought maybe he was from wealthy stock, but many of the goods have been delivered recently. I'd love to bring him to task in front of Count Indaris, but I dare not without a solid witness that will speak against him. Honestly, she's never done anything to be fined or get in trouble. Yet. The person I'd love to bring in as a witness is Aldos Arthurin. That is, if we could sober him up for five minutes. I haven't approached him myself, as Ulrich has eyes everywhere. However, he doesn't know you well enough yet to suspect anything. If you want to help, you need to get Aldos to agree to become a witness. Nothing else can be done. Aldos is living on the street now that his house has been seized. I begged Ulrich to give him more time, but he wouldn't. He won't be hard to find. Just follow the smell of stale mead. Beware of Ulrich. I wouldn't confront him at this time, as he'll surely have you thrown in jail. If you raise a hand against him and strike him down, you'll be accused of murder. Even if Ulrich doesn't do things by the letter of the law, I do. You must locate Aldos. He's a danger to himself and others in his condition. What? You're a likely looking prospect. Join the guild. You won't regret it. Stand clear. Who are you? Ha! That stupid Swit! Throw me out of my home, will he? I'll show him a thing or two about messing with an Othran. All I did was fall down, sure. Maybe even vomited on the floor of the tavern. Charge me six times, Ulrich! Charge me, you fetcher! Well, I'm not standing for this anymore. You come with me and I'll show you what the Othrans can do when their backs are to the wall. Greetings, Breton. Stand clear. Get out of my way. This is my house. Get out of the way. Move, I say. Sir, 
This property has been seized by his lordship, the Count of Chadenhall. Leave immediately. I said move, or by my ancestors, I'll put you on the ground with a split lip. Sir, I must warn you that threatening a city guardsman is an offense punishable by a fine of no less than 50 gold. Pay, or be jailed. You swit! How dare you! Ulrich be damned! He can take his fine and stuff it up his backside. You've been warned. You are now under arrest. Please, come with me. I'll go nowhere with you, Fetcher. Nowhere! Move along. You saw what happened? I had no choice. Aldous attacked first, and I had to defend myself. If you don't like it, take it up with Ulrich. Move along, please. What's wrong? Oh no, they killed him? I can't believe this. Ever since his wife passed at the hands of the bandits, his life has been miserable. I'd grown to become fond of him. I wanted to take him into my house, but I was afraid. And now look what's become of him. There are no more options left. Ulrich must be dealt with, and actions speak louder than words. You must do something for me. Go tell Ulrich that I have some information that incriminates him. Tell him to come alone, or he won't get it. Then lead him here, and I'll do the rest. I'll make the necessary arrangements for his burial. He'll be buried next to his poor wife. I'll do... Ulrich will not buy his way out of this one. Upon me as we, speak. we must put an end to this travesty of justice. Aldos will be mourned. I won't sit by and watch the innocent being driven to the brink like that. Something must be done, but without bloodshed. Levana has always been quick-tempered. You must reconsider her plan. It can only lead to prison for her and for you. I swear that Ulrich will pay for this. We must handle this carefully and prove to the Count that he needs to be arrested. Ulrich has been watching me, so I haven't been able to enact a plan I devised to bring him down. That ends today, now that you're here. The evidence we need to incriminate Ulrich must lie within his quarters. You must sneak in there and retrieve it without being seen. If you're caught, there isn't anything I can do to help you. Just be careful. Aldos' death is indeed a tragedy. We'll do what we can to put his soul to the
Eleven of the morning watch and all's well. You too. You're back. Good. Did you find the evidence? You've done it! This letter will spell his undoing when I present it to Count Indaris. Splendid work. Splendid work indeed. I must hasten to the Count and deliver this immediately. Please, meet me back at the Chaden Hall Bridge Inn in about two hours. I must speak to the Count. Speaking to the Count, and in light of the evidence you recovered, Ulrich has been removed from his post and arrested. Many guards are coming forward with more evidence of his greed, so it's safe to say he'll be spending quite a bit of time in the city dungeons. I've been promoted to the post of Captain of the Guard, and hope to return respect to the peacekeepers of this town. The Count and I thank you for helping bring Ulrich's hold on Chaden Hall to an end, and for doing so without unnecessary bloodshed. As a token of our gratitude, as you did this, at the risk of false imprisonment, or perhaps your life, we reward you this bounty of gold. On behalf of the people of Chaden Hall, I thank you. Ulrich will be spending years in the city dungeons. This should give him plenty of time to reflect on what he's done. Until we meet again, may you dream.